Welcome students. Our today's topic is time and calendar. This is unit 8 and it's part 2. We will do the questions from 5th of revision exercise. So before doing uh, those questions, let us understand this thing first. We write 12 noon for 12 in the morning and 12 midnight for the 12 for uh, in the night. So the time between 12 noon to 12 midnight is written as pm and the time between 12 midnight to 12 noon is written as am. Let us understand this by doing these questions. Question number 5 is write am or pm. Now here 7.30 in the morning that means the time is between 12 midnight to 12 noon. So we will write am and 140 in the afternoon now afternoon that means the time is after the 12 noon so this is pm quarter to 12 at night now quarter to 12 at night the time is between 12 uh, midnight to 12 noon to 12 midnight so we will write pm here 11:59 in the morning so am 9.15 in the night, so we will write p.m. 12.25 in the night, here, here students you have to pay attention because this is 12.25 in the night, we, we usually write um, p.m. for uh, the time when we write the time for, in, uh, for night and a.m. for morning. But in this case because we have to uh, see that this is 2.25 in the night. That means the time is between 12 midnight and 12 noon. That means here we have to write am not pm. 20 minutes past 10 in the morning. So we will write am here. Now fill in the blanks with am or pm. I go to play at 4. You will play in the evening. So 4 pm. I go to bed at 10.30. You will sleep in night. So you have to write PM here. My grandma goes to temple at 7.30 in the morning. So you have to write AM. My father listens TV news in 9, uh, sorry at 9 in the night. Now in the night so we have to write PM. Right. Coming on to question number 7. How many days are there in a month in which the following important days fall republic day now republic day comes in january 26th of january so january has 31 days teachers day comes on 5th of september and september has 30 days so write 30 here christmas comes on 25th of december and december has 31 days so write 31 here independence day comes on 15th of August so write uh, August has 31 days so write 31 here children day falls on 14th of November and November has 30 days so write 30 here ok students now for the next fill in the blanks this is question number 8 one day is equals to 24 hours one hour is equals to 60 minutes so we will write 60 here C part in the C part 120 minutes is equals to dash hours right. So now because we know that 1 hour is equals to 60 minutes 60 plus and uh, 60 is equals to 120. So we will write 2 hours here. December has you all know we have done this in the previous question also 31 days so we will write 31 here. June comes after the month of May after May what comes June so May is the answer write May here. In a year, dash months have 30 days. You can count them and you can write it here. We have 4 months which have 30 days. I hope students the questions are clear to you all and you will do these uh, in, in your books itself because it's a book exercise. Thank you.